welcome fellow bosses, Freddy the Spartan King here and today I'm bringing you a review, the review of the M16A4 post patch, post the 25th March patch that came out and specifically addressed and fixed the problems with the M4 and the M16A4 being really underpowered and underused and specifically it says over here on Badlock that they reduced the vertical recall of the M4 and the M16A4 to give these burst fire weapons a tighter burst accuracy in their mid to long range roll. So that definitely buffed the weapons, I'm not gonna go into extreme amounts of uh, deep characteristics that uh, will definitely bore you, I will definitely say that the really strong side of the M16A4 is muzzle velocity, it suits with 650 meters per second which is probably at the very like at the very top of the game so that's a its strong side and with shooting 800 rpm 650 meters per second it's just crazy man and now that they reduced the recall uh, which is kind of on the low side now it's only 0.28 and not, not a lot of people not a lot of weapons have 0 0.28 uh, vertical recall now the first bullet recall is kind of on the high side 2.5 all the other stuff is standard except of the reload time with the short reload time guys is only at 1.8 seconds that means like less than two seconds and along with that 800 rpm that really low vertical recoil and that 650 meters per second muzzle velocity that makes it amazing for any kind of situations especially if you have a trigger figure or if like me you have trigger stops on your controller because I use my own modded controllers there are a couple of links in the description below if you're interested and you can really spam the trigger with trigger stops on your controller and really kill in close quarters and burst in long range and as you saw the clip at the very start you can snap with that thing and I would definitely recommend using a 3.4 scope on it and maybe a folding grip or an angle grip, doesn't really matter which one. I don't think that there's like this weapon needs any, it definitely doesn't need a compensator. It might need a little bit of muzzle break, but I don't recommend it if you want to go long range because it will reduce your accuracy. So in general it's a really lovable gun right now, I haven't seen a single person, not a single person in all my battle for hours using this weapon, it's really under power right now. Nobody came out on YouTube and said hey dude they buffed the burst weapons, so I would definitely say guys go right now slap on your M16A4 with a really good side, definitely a 3.4 is absolutely amazing, if you want to use a laser side, a folding grip. Um, or an angle grip, whatever, and a 3.4. It's a really versatile weapon, and you need a trigger figure or a trigger stop on your on your right trigger at least. Anyway, so yeah, that's about it. And uh, as always, guys, stay bows. I'm out.